once you put that West Virginia across your chest, and once you go out and represent this great state and the great people in this state, you're always going to be one of us. Tremendous intensity here in Morgantown. This building has been rocking, especially the student section right behind us from the outset. It's an opportunity to come to a place where you know you're going to win. An opportunity to play in the NCAA tournament and, and an opportunity to, to be showcased. teams to compete with. We are the flagship school. We display West Virginia University across our chest every time we go out to play. Nothing but accomplishments his whole career. And then has done nothing but win since he got here. No doubt about it. The guy knows how to coach. Not only knows how to recruit, motivate, and he was an honors graduate from West Virginia. I thought it was a great combo. We talked to Jim Beheim a couple of weeks ago and he said of all the terrific coaches in this league, and there are a lot of excellent coaches, he said, I think Bob Huggins does the best job coaching his team of any coach in the league. 700 career wins for Huggins. Three's 10th in winning percentage among Division I active head coaches. Yeah, this is his fifth year, or years in the NCAA tournament. Fourth in total victories. 20th in the all-time Division I wins list. He is certainly one of the great coaches of his era. Career point score to another. Shoot the ball for the win. The shot's up. Yeah. 3.3 seconds to go. Bryant tied it at the end of regulation, and he wins it in overtime. Bryant, the best perimeter defender on this West Virginia team. Even though he can light it up. Truck Bryant showing you why he's one of the stronger guards in the Big East Conference. Who gonna stop me? Our senior experience of toughness. Who gonna stop me? Boy, Kevin Jones is everywhere. When you look at Jones, he doesn't do one thing phenomenal, but he just can do a little bit of everything. Whether it's rebounding, knocking down shots, crashing the glass, running the floor, defending. Having a huge year. Now the best player in the Big East. Outstanding rebounding ability this kid possesses, though, Jay. I, I just understands where the ball's going, how to get there. He's scoring, he's rebounding, he's directing traffic, blocking shots. Only two players in conference history have led in scoring and rebounding over a season. Jones trying to become number three. Always around, always doing business. There are two players in West Virginia history with 1,700 points and a thousand rebounds for their careers. Seems to be playing with a chip on his shoulder. That's the way to go. Go to the money guy. Who gonna stop me? Well, this practice facility is the best in the country. And it will be until somebody tries to build one better. And that's what we set out to do. You know, when we went around and talked to people about building this and supporting it, uh, number one, people were absolutely phenomenal in their acceptance and particularly in the fact that let's build the best. I mean, we're going to build the best practice facility there is in America. Uh, we don't have to take a second seat to anybody. And, and we haven't taken a second seat to anybody. Our guys can come in, work on their game 24-7. They have 24-7 access to the gym and a place to come in and shoot, work at their game. 
and then an opportunity to play in a, at a school that has unbelievable tradition. And when, you know, when you look at West Virginia people, that you look at Jerry West, uh, the, the, the great uh, storied history of Rod Thorne. We have great history and, and, and great people, and it's an opportunity for guys to pursue their dreams. And just the opportunity that West Virginia University can be the best. I've been in the Big 12. I was in the Big 12 for a year, so you know I have firsthand experience of, of what it is. And I, and I think what the Big 12 is, people in the Big 12 have the best home court advantage of any league in America. The student involvement in the Big 12 is phenomenal. The playing atmosphere in the Big 12 is probably the best atmosphere as there is any conference in the country. I don't think there's a, a conference that can match it top to bottom. The enthusiasm that the crowds in, in those various arenas display. And, and the other thing is it's, it's been extremely successful. I think when you look at uh, Final Four appearances in the last 10 or 12 years, you, you look at uh, national rankings, you look at the, the players, the national players of the year, uh, the, the consensus first team All-Americans, there's been great players in it. And, and obviously there's been great coaches in the league as well. We have the best people in the world. People who love West Virginia, people who love West Virginia University. It's a very unique place. be on national TV. That's what guys want. Guys want opportunity to, to be on television, to be seen, and, and to be able to compete at the highest level, and we certainly afford that. And then an opportunity to, to come and play in the best practice facility in America. With us being here with five consecutive NCAA tournament appearances, we're going to keep on going. It will end up being the most consecutive NCAA tournament appearances in the history of this storied program, I think, which says a lot. And Final Four appearance and uh, a Sweet 16, it needs not be a one-time thing. It needs to be an all-the-time thing. Once you put that West Virginia across your chest, and once you go out and represent this great state and the great people in this state, you're always going to be one of us. Yeah.